Let's make step by step the piston head install to work. These are all the commands that you will learn while we make together this amazing drawing. If you want to follow along with me, just go ahead and download the blueprint below. Let's start. I will start by activate the front plane and then go to the line, center line, and then click make the line right that. Okay, now activate again the lines and then goes and make this sketch. Goes down, goes left, like that. So I'm just here making the sketch, the simple sketch like that, and then go down, goes to the right, and goes to the tops. Now right again, like that. Okay. Now let me here um, use the smart dimension and start making my dimension. Okay, we'll come here and then put uh, 42. And um, here will be 13. Good. And here, let's see. Le le okay, here will be 4. I'm just here. Okay. Okay. Um, let me just here make the dimension. In this part like that and here will be will be four okay uh, okay like that will be four good okay um oh. we'll just see here you go back and um maybe i need uh, to make one relation first we'll just go back and uh, select everything here and make equal so they must be equal now let me here uh, dimension which is four okay they are all equal good now let me here uh, continue making the dimension. Smart dimension and here will be two. Okay, like there in uh, this part. So here will be two as well in the uh, other side and here will be seven. Good. And here will be 10. And here will be three. Good. Now let me here continue, and uh, here in this side will be 35, 37. Yes, 37 is better. And here um, 30.15. Okay. Good. Let's just here uh, press F and then um, make this position. Okay. Um, now let me continue make my dimension, and here will be 59.26. 16 I mean uh, maybe I need to delete this part here because okay let's see here delete here 12 okay let me here first delete this 30.15 now come here 12.80 so that's I think right it is better like that now let's me here um, go to this feature and then revolve so that's the initial uh, drawing right so Let's see here, continue work on that. Now, we'll go uh, down, select, uh, again, front plane, and then goes to the center rectangle. And then here, we'll just make the center rectangle, like that. And then I make the dimension. So here will be uh, 52, and here will be 45. Good, now let me here use the Exit the cut and then it will be uh, through all both. Then I click OK. So it is now done. Okay, now uh, let me go down right in inside. I'll we'll just here uh, first go to the fillet and then uh, uh, will it be the fillet will be 10 in uh, this side there as well. He as well and uh, he as well. Now we'll put here uh, 10. Okay, good. Now let me go inside. And uh, inside sketch now here I need to um, convert entity so not not like that I want all the sequel we'll just here go back okay we'll just go back here right good now I need to select all the the sequel inside okay like that and then convert entity okay that's the one I want now we'll make a, a line in the middle just go to the line then I put here one line right in the middle. Now I will use the offset, and here will be B. There is no very important here. Click B, there is none, and then size 15, click both. Now let's here use the trim and cut everything here, right? So I'm just here cutting using the trim, just on the also delete this line here inside. Okay, good. Now 
I will use the extrude and here the extrude let's see um, I want um, in the extrude uh, let's see 50 let's see here uh, must be let me see not okay let me here try 25 no must be mod, more than that so let me here put 50 okay and then uh, maybe 60 okay now it is better like that 60 56 that the rate size okay now um, let me work um, as well inside and, and make that hole right in a the so that the hole for the pin hole that will hold um okay, let me here go and then put uh, like like that so right and then put just as a a C coder then we need to make the dimension so now let's here go to the, to the dimension right and then here uh, so must be 26 not 20 24 so 26 okay that rate size now let me here go to the and put here the dimension will it be, uh, will it be uh, 16 okay that's that's better that's good now we need to uh, make here more dimension must be fully defined um let's go okay maybe we need to make a uh, size for that maybe we need to make the relation okay let's let's me dislike that and make a, a relation vertical now it is fully defined so that's good now let's go to the extrude cut again and then it will be uh, through all both so that's the way it is done it is it is good so it is better now let me here do one more fillet of 10 in uh, this uh, edge right you know uh, the bottom and then click okay so that's that's good that's what i want now we'll work on uh, uh, the top so not that in the combustion chamber so there is a combustion chamber right on the piston so we need to make that it is all good now let me work on the top so what will be the last um, activity here we'll just here activate the, the line and uh, as well use uh, the dy dynamic mirror entities right must be vertical dynamic mirror entities and then activate the line again and make that uh, uh, curve effect so not not this one let's just here go back right i just need to go back and then activate again and activate the line like that go back okay that's the one it wants click there okay and then go back again and then go back again okay that's what it wants and then uh, click there click there now let's here make the dimensions and uh, right there uh, here must be 10 and here must be 9 and here will be 17 so that pretty much it now extrude the cut again and here uh, we're gonna put 0 0.4 okay it must be 0, 0 0.4 and then click ok by the way is 0 0.4 not 0 0.2 uh, I'm saying 3.4 but it puts 0 0.2 0 0.4 okay that's the right dimension so that's pretty much about the piston head as you can see so it is already complete now we're gonna here just make uh, the last uh, update which is uh, you know material metal and here in the body i will just here uh, use this uh, styles and uh, inside will be um, metal black that's pretty much about the piston head and please don't forget to subscribe consider to watch this video here as well and I'll see you to the next one